Okay. Um, make sure you have your sniper rifle out. Um, because this room is a just it's a total bitch. Um, if you get lucky and get all the way through it, you know I, I've had it. You know, about ninety percent of the time I get through this with little to no problems. Other times it's just a total pain in the ass. Uh, it all depends on the enemy's actions. Um, there are two ways to get through this room. Um, you can either do what I'm about to do with the sniper rifle, or you can get out a hand grenade and just run up to the red cloak guy. Uh, well, at least near him, um, until the shield guys get way too close for comfort, where they can hit you. Uh, just throw the grenade and make sure you can kill off the two shield guys. Uh, but if you're quick enough, you can do it the way I'm about to do it. Um, then as soon as those two are down, go ahead and get out a hand grenade. Throw it. Get out your shotgun while that's about to blow up. And then run. Just oh fuck, I went I got caught in the ledge. Damn it. Okay, we got I got well, I shouldn't say we I got lucky there. I guess never mind, I'm just gonna get grabbed anyway. Um so I'll have to heal. Uh, at least we got the two crossbow guys down. Um, that's the most important thing. We needed them dead. Motherfucker. Okay, we're things are getting a little intense in, in this area. Um, oh shit. Um no. I was praying something like that wouldn't happen, but it did anyway. Um, as you can see this guy takes a lot more damage than the rest to take out and where did you come from my good sir because you came in fast <laughs> holy crap um, As you can see, things are even getting intense in this room. Oh wow! Um, that is a first. <laughs> I can tell you that right now. Um, that red cloak guy. Every and I mean every single time I have ever played this area. He has spawned one of those parasites. That is the first out of 120 or so playthroughs of this game where he did not. Um, uh, hopefully you get that lucky. I'm really hoping that you guys get that lucky for that to happen. Um, but uh, we'll, uh, well, hopefully we'll see what happens. Um, now we're gonna try and walk outside. I can still hear him chanting. Well, come on then. Hopefully, we can lead him back into this room. They're just—they're a lot more manageable in this room. Wait. Outside, it's just there's so much going on that you can, just really, you can really get killed out there. Um, in here, like I said, it's just a lot more manageable. 
Okay, here comes a shield guy. Um, with the sniper, you can shoot through their shield if you know where their head is at and kill them without having to break the shield. But for the most part, you just want to get out a shotgun and break the shield. I don't know why I needed to reload. Um, that could actually got me very killed. Um, okay. Uh, we'll go make an attempt of getting outside again. Um, we'll see what happens. There's a shield guy right behind us. There's this dickhead right in front of us with another shield. Here, see what we're dealing with. Okay. Oh, maybe it wasn't a shield guy, maybe it was just a mace guy. Flail, whatever. Um, yeah. Hoping that is the last guy we have to deal with right now, because um, we're gonna go down to the bottom again, flip a switch, uh, pull up a what should we call it? A uh, crank. Um, I don't see anybody else. Okay, um, let's find out here what will happen when we go pull that switch and see where all the enemy spawns are going to be as soon as we get out the door. Um, <clears throat> always be wary of your surroundings when you're running through. Sometimes I'm not because I'm too focused on trying to get this done in a timely fashion. Follow me. Um, We're gonna run to the left, shoot out this shield guy, shoot him down, and run. Because there's probably another shield guy behind us. Shoot these two out of the way. He spawned a parasite, we're just gonna run right by that. Turn around. Okay, our best bet will probably be the TMP, just a lot of fire just to kind of pin them all down. Um, shield guy gets close again, obviously. Shotgun. I made a mistake right there. I chose to reload instead of getting ready to. instead of switching guns to shoot him. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and heal again. Try and get to that rifle ammo. Okay, I don't see. Ah, oh, damn it! It disappeared. Shit. That was ammo we could have used too. Well, let's just uh, try and finish him off, I guess. Hopefully, he stops running here in a sec. Okay, good. Put him on the ground. No, Ashley, you can't just sit still wherever you want. No! That is why. God, what a dumb bitch. I swear, she's the only flaw that's really in this game. Because she's just a 
dumbass. Shotgun loaded again. Okay, go ahead, tell Ashley to go to the crank. Hopefully nobody else shows up because that's the last thing you need right now. Keep the shotgun out because we're gonna need to blast away some of these guys here as soon as I, those stairs get down. see anybody. Ready and here they come. Okay. Now since they're all kind of bundled up, we might as well just use a grenade. There we go. Okay. Now I got killed this one. You know what? I really don't want to use any more shotgun ammo than I have to. Because the next part is just as difficult. Okay, let's go make sure we got everything we need. Um, Open this up. Uh, one of these has a first aid spray, which uh, you will probably need um, if the, definitely if things weren't going your way on this uh, area. Because uh, I don't know if it was because of me trying to record or not, but I ain't gonna lie to you, I ended up dying. Not dying, but I died about four times and I had to restart about three times recording uh, other times. Um, so a total of seven times we restarted this recording because I was just having no luck whatsoever. Um, I was just getting, I was making simple little mistakes that were just screwing me around every single turn. And the only reason why they're not in the recording is because this area is, it, it would have made this area instead of two, maybe three parts to do this part, it would have made it, <coughs> it would have made it five or six if not more. And I just, if for the purpose of this guide, if, I mean, if I die, you know, and it's not a big deal, not a major area that just is going to take a while, I'll, I mean, you guys will, you know, it'll, you'll see it happen. But it, in just, just because of this area, I just, I almost didn't even want to play anymore. I just, <laughs> I haven't had, let's just say I did worse now than I did when I first ever played this game. I died maybe twice when I first played this game ever. But I to fuck up that many times, I got so pissed. Um, but while uh, while we prepare, we might as well uh, finish up grabbing these items around this room. Look, there's a crank over there. Okay, there's we're gonna be sending her up there on her own, and that's what's gonna make this part a bitch. Um, is we gotta watch her and our ass. So um, go ahead, grab the ammo you need up here. Um, we're gonna send her to the left one first. But, uh, we'll start that here in a sec. <laughs> 